Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. DK Web Design Studio here. Let's go through today how to create a member's site to your Wix website, a member's area, along with a member's forum. This is really important because a member's area without a forum is just a member's area where people can go in and, and create an account and um, interact with different paid features of your site. But the forum allows for interaction between members. And also it's a great way for you to provide premium content to the members that join your site. So this is really easy to do and I'm gonna show you guys in a couple of clicks how you can set this up. So first off, uh, from your dashboard, click edit site and we're gonna jump into our website and right away, click the plus button on the left side menu and let's scroll on down to members. Add a members area. You can get to it here or you can go to add apps and we can type in member here and then Wix members area. So we'll click on that app. That's This is the preferable way to do it and it's free. We're gonna add to the site. It doesn't have the best ratings, but it's still, it's functional. It works great. All right, we've added the members area. This profile card is showing up, creating its own section, its own page. Um, and there you go. Now look, we actually have a new page added to our navigation called members. Pretty cool. And it also adds this login bar at the top. Now you can rearrange where this login bar shows up, especially if it's overlapping some social media icons that you have. So just reconfigure your uh, your header to basically make sure that that fits appropriately where you want it to in the on the desktop view. And I think when you get to the mobile view, that members members area will show up uh, within this navigation menu. We give we click edit down here in members, and then you're also the login buttons at the top. We can just rearrange that if we want. Um, and that's. That's it, so now we have a members area. Members area is great because now when people are gonna book or buy something from you, they can log in, they can become a member, they can customize their their bookings, their um, credit card information, settings, etc. Uh, a lot of different things they can do here and a lot of information that you can gain about your customers. Um, all right, so then from this screen, what we want to do now is add the forum. So it's not immediately evident where the forum button is. In fact, from here, you can't even tell if there's a, for if there's a forum at all, uh, really. And it's, it's, it can be kind of confusing. Um, make sure that looks good. All right, so the forum is another app. We're going to go back down to add apps. Go here, type in forum and we're gonna add the Wix forum. Now, the reason to keep it Wix forum is because it's gonna automatically integrate with your members, uh, your members space app. And that automatic integration is really, really convenient. You don't have to do any backend customization, no API programming, no database programming. Um, the default look of the forum, I don't necessarily like. So what we wanna do quickly once it shows up uh, is just go straight up to the layout, um, disable the header. There's no need to have a big forums header on the top or you can make it really small, change the font. Uh, that looks way better. The other thing is if you have all caps on your menu, you wanna go to your um, menus and pages and let's just rename that to all caps. So it looks a little bit better. Uh, the other thing we want to do, uh, let's look at the settings of that page, layouts and permissions. You know, the forum button, we want to make it a members only page. So only people that are that are logged in and signed up can see that if you want to keep the forum more private, right? Uh, and so there's the page for the forum and people can post in the forum. Um, and then the other thing is, let's go ahead and preview the site. Let's look at the members area. So now what you'll notice is, um, actually I might have to go here. 
look at this. Now we have forum comments and we have forum posts, both added to the members area. And so from here, we can see, uh, we can see my posts. I can edit them from here. Uh, the only thing is I can't create um, new posts from here. We have to create po posts from the forum, but we can manage the posts from our members area. So if we want to create a new post, just click create a new post. And then normally it'll pop up and I'll be able to actually edit that new post. I think we have to be in publish view. So let's go ahead and publish the site, go to view site. Let's go to the forum. So this is what it would look like live. And then I would click create new post and say, this is great. Welcome everyone, right? Publish. It's to show the functionality. Oh, we got to select the category. So I've actually created, there's a general discussions, which is automatic. And then I've created a couple, which you can, you can go ahead and manage that from within your settings. So you can create some different categories and manage it uh, as the admin or the owner of the form. Uh, and there you go. So we've got a new form posted. We click back on forum. Um, this is great right here. It's under general discussions, three comments. Uh, and we can, people can follow different, different forum posts. You can customize if only admins can create forum posts or make it open to the community. From the members area, we saw, um, not from this page actually, but um, from the, here's, here's the actual member section over here, uh, forum posts over here, um, forum comments, you can manage it from there, you can get notifications, you can change the settings around all of this. Uh, actually, the, the user can change their own notifications and customize them, uh, I think under settings. Yeah, blog notifications, uh, forum digest, you can get weekly or, or daily. You can, you can get notifications for comments, following, news reports, etc. So a lot of things you can do here. Uh, pretty easy to set up. We just created the members area. We just created the forum uh, and it all integrated automatically. We're good to go now. Guys, I hope this video was helpful. Leave me a comment below, like, subscribe to the channel. As always, hit that bell notification button. We're gonna be posting videos uh, frequently, so you'll get the notice as soon as I post a new video. Thank you so much and have a great rest of the week.